Hey guys, welcome to Rainbow Tech and I'm Vish. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to unlock bootloader and how to root your Motorola Moto G 3rd generation, which is Osprey 2015 version XT1550. So let's get started. So first and foremost, if you root your cell phone, then you will not get warranty. Your warranty will be void. And if something went wrong, then you can't go and claim your warranty in Motorola's service center. So if something went wrong, you have to pay for that. So this is the first instruction. So I'm not responsible for anything that goes wrong. So uh, to root, uh, to unlock your bootloader and to root, you need the three files. So first one is minimal ADB fast boot. I, have, um, I will give the link in the description of this video. So download minimal ADB fast boot. Here is the download link and TWRP a custom recovery. Download it also. Here is the link where you can download. Here is the source code link. And uh, here is the download link. You can download it here. And you have to download and uh, install the uh, Super Su. Super Su 2.76 is the latest version. And you can download it here. This is the link. You can download anything. You have to download the zip file. So, as you can see, uh, here is the minimal ADB fast food. So, go click and install. Okay. After that, TWRP recovery and update super as super shoe. To unlock bootloader, you need to download Motorola device manager software. So I will give the link in the description of the video. So here you can download it for Windows and here is for Mac OS. And click on download and download the file. Here you can see I have already downloaded it. I have already downloaded the file. Then click and install it. Go to setting. Go to about phone. Go to bill now. Tap on bill number for seven times, and you will get developer option. Go to developer option and click on OEM unlock. Enter your PIN or password. And it will show you instruction allow volume unlock. Click on enable and also unlock the and uh, check the USB debugging and press OK. Go to Motorola's device unlocking bootloader website. I'll give the link in the description of this video. And here you can read the instructions, the routing instructions, and the, uh, click on next. Here you can see all the commands. So first connect your device to USB cable. As we have enabled the USB debugger option. After connecting your Motorola Moto G3 to your computer through USB cable search for minimal ADB fastboot 
and click on the and type adb devices so as you can see my device is connected here and let's go to bootloader type adb reboot bootloader can see the bootloader menu battery level is ok and uh, unlocks device is locked status code is 0 now copy the fastboot oem get unlock data this command and uh, paste it here And here we go. We got this unlock data. So we have to copy this data. Press here, go to edit and uh, copy. And here in the new notepad paste that paste that and uh, remove all spaces and this bootloader also So now copy this code and paste it here click on can my device be unlocked here is the procedure notice you have to click on agree and Request unlock key. Yeah, here you can see, unless you have a developer edition device, this will void your warranty. Are you sure? Click on OK. Unlock your bootloader. Step 3. Here is a step 3 here you can see I got the mail from Motorola copy this code go here and read these instructions here you can see in ADB type fast port OEM unlock unlock data and press enter here you can see it's unlocking the device it will take some time after that your phone will reboot here you can see device is unlocked Status code is 3. My device is unlocked. So I will restart it. Press power button. And it will show the warning bootloader unlock message. You can see I am almost done. It is uh, re uh, re restored my phone. Again tap on build number 7 times 
to get uh, developer option and go to developer option and lock why man lock also enable usb debugging that's it you can you have to go to bootloader now to install custom recovery and to root your cell phone now you have just unlocked your bootloader to do that press power and volume down key long term long power plus volume down for some 10 seconds then you will get the bootloader option here you can see the device is unlocked and status code is 3 now connect your device to your computer now go to the folder where you have the recovery file and here type fast boot devices and you will get the device which is in the fast boot mode now type fast boot flash recovery and drag that recovery file here press enter now go to recovery recovery option recovery mode now you can go to twrp recovery here you can see team one recovery and it's showing keep system read only read only instructions so I want to do the modifications so swipe here to do the modifications here you can see click on install and go up and here you can go to external SD and select update update as you super as you and confirm the flash and swipe here to confirm the flash as you can see the super as you is flashing It will take some time. Yeah, it's done. Press on reboot to system. Started to reboot. As you can see, we have a root checker application. So click on this. And after rooting you guys, you can you, you can click on verify your root as you can see congratulations root access is properly installed on this device you can see this option this means you have successfully rooted your cell phone that's all guys thank you for watching if you think this video is useful and then go ahead and like it and also subscribe my channel for more updates and new videos and also watch my previous videos share this video thank you